Again, I'd like to say thank you to Tarquin, to Glenn, Gerald, John, Ken, uh, for a fascinating morning, and to Your Majesty and our other guests here for attending today, which is a really important day for the Atlantic Salmon Trust um, and important for a lot of people that have been involved with the Trust for a long time. Um, coming from a Trust background, a local Trust background, the influence that the AST has had and the help that it has given to support local work has been very important to us. So, summing up today, the subject of salmon is notoriously difficult to communicate its life cycle, the issues it faces, and the need to conserve it. Non-anglers and non-scientists find it difficult to comprehend. There's plenty of fish in the supermarkets, so what's the problem? In addition to that, it has a conservation status, and yet it is exploited. So, the salmon has a conservation, economic, and sporting value and it lives in freshwater and seawater. So you can understand my problem when Tarquin says we need to find a clear message that anglers can understand. Gerard also explained how important it is for us to conserve in the freshwater as well in, in the marine environment. Both are interconnected and if we don't produce a healthy smolt going out to sea we risk diminishing our opportunity of having healthy adults returning. We know there's a problem. Scientists and fisheries managers are studying this, and anglers can see and feel it. For years we've been doing a lot in the freshwater environment, but until recently the technology just hasn't been there to make investigations at sea. Glenn and John showed us some of the new technology but Gerald also explained to us that we have material that is still available to be analysed. So I'm moving backwards now. Tarquin talked of the need of us to work together. We have partners from the Atlantic, from across the Atlantic here today, and even from the Pacific. And the AST is ready to work together with those partners. I really believe that the suspects model that Ken presented will enable us to focus conservation efforts and manage actions to protect and improve stocks of wild Atlantic salmon in a strategic way. And all of that will make my job a lot easier. I'd like to end it there and take you all out to lunch. Thank you very much.